Oh yeah, I am Sinku, our PRP Chairmanship uh, as Parental Guardian South Local Government pledged to prioritize youth empowerment through trade training and also skills acquisition, focusing on reviving industries to create job opportunities and generate revenue. Uh, Shink also pledged to strengthen education and health care. Whoever is coming to go into the office, whatever is going to go into the when they get into the office. So that when you hear today, you say, Mr. Chairman, before you come into the office, these are the promises you make. And we want the chairman that will be the leading chairman. We don't want the chairman that will be the party chairman. That after the election, you are now the leader of the people's chairman. This is what we want to see in our local government. I'm interested in our members that we have means of engaging our youths and providing for them in terms of products, subsidy, or assistance to be served in products. And equally, when you come to empower, it should not get talk about youth. The only also have to be involved. We have also many other associations that have the idea of training women in various provisions. I have told them in my manifesto, we have decided to also launch a program for women. Yusuf Parman debate convener emphasized the end of vote buying and token by the uh, politics of residents' votes based on candidates' competence and credible leadership. We want the stakeholders to decide who should be the leaders of local government, not vote buying, not giving us spaghetti and talia. No, let the people. So when we elected a representative, it should be the person we elected. We don't want violence. Please, anybody that wins, they should give him. When we're looking for, for somebody that's credible from any party, we don't have any party at heart. You should deceive us now. It's about good governance, and good governance, everybody must come and contribute his quota. If we don't decide now who should lead us, anybody can go there, can do whatever he wants to do. And we don't want a leader that will be answerable to his political party. We want a leader that will be answerable to the people. Power should shift to the people. I think that is the essence of democracy. That is how they define democracy. In an urban local government such as Kedunosa local government, all you have to do is to improve on human capital development. Once our youth are engaged and they have something doing, you will have some relevant fees in the local government. And as far as some other uh, criminal activities, I'm sure it is due to lack of engaging these youth into various fields of which they have shown their interest. So with this, I'm sure once in office, we'll be able to identify those youth that are usually causing this type of problems in the society. We'll ask them what they want, and by the grace of God, we'll make sure we'll provide for them so that at the end of the day, it will not be an excuse for anybody to be engaged in doing The event ended with a call for credible elections and governors are prioritized the people's... Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.